Camera number 120 of 365, and it's the Minolta X300. The camera requires batteries to operate, so let's just start by placing batteries in the base of the camera. So the batteries are two LR44 batteries, and they sit in this cradle. And then we can put, with the positive terminal facing down into the camera, it back in, and then screw the cover of the battery compartment on. While I'm doing that, you notice that there is a provision to fit a motor wind. Uh, I do have that, but uh, I've not used it on this particular camera. So there's the uh, contacts and the uh, motor drive. Uh, the little button that uh, deactivates the film advance and allows us to wind our film back into our camera. Looking at the front of the camera, to remove the lens we simply uh, press the top button and uh, rotate anti-clockwise. Uh, for the photos I use this uh, Minolta uh, Rocker 28mm 3.5 lens, very nice lens. I do one of my favourite lenses uh, using these type of cameras. I do like uh, it very much. And then uh, looking at the front of the camera uh, we have uh, an option to fit a cable release and then on the other side, uh, you probably notice there, this little uh, button, if we move it up, is a self-timer. So if we turn the camera on, and you see the, uh, the red light counting down. And then releasing the shutter. If we press it down, it uh, turns that off. Uh, but then we do have the other option of uh, activating uh, auto exposure lock by pressing the button down. It's quite nice, it fits with the uh, f little finger there, so we, ha we can keep our eye to the viewfinder, our finger on the button of the uh, shutter, and actuate the switch as well with our other finger. So that's quite uh, well designed, well thought out. Uh, that's pretty much it uh, in terms of uh, what's on the front of the camera, so we're just return the lens back to the camera. And then looking on the top plate we have the uh, on-off switch and then our film rewind and then we also have you might just be able to see around the collar there our film speed switch we have to unlock the dial and then we can rotate it to our desired film speed. And then on the other side Set uh, on auto, the camera is an aperture expo aperture priority camera, and uh, we see the shutter speeds down the right hand side of the viewfinder. Uh, but we can move it on to manual, and then we control both the aperture and the shutter speeds. And again, through the viewfinder, we have uh, the shutter speeds, and they're illuminated by LEDs one that the camera thinks, and the second one is the one that we've uh, chosen. So we can really have uh, full manual control over that. We have our film advance and as I say shutter actuation and then we have uh, film counter on uh, the side there. Okay, uh, that's it. To take uh, our film out and put it back in, we simply lift the collar of the rewind and then that opens the door and allows us to put film and take our film out. So that is it. That is camera number 120 of 365, the Minolta X300.